All right, guys, so this is probably going to be the biggest piggy theory that I've made in a very, very long time. And if this turns out to be true, it could probably be one of the biggest things in the piggy storyline. So for the people that watch my live streams regularly, you might already know what I'm talking about. But this theory is specifically about Pony and him being an ex-member of TSP. Real quick, if you don't know, Pony is an ex-member of the Silver Paw TSP. It's revealed at the end of the piggy book two, chapter two cutscene. Willow Wolf basically tells Pony like, hey, you were an ex-member you left the group and i don't like you very much anymore and then pony turns around and says look you know this group they did a lot of bad things i had to do a lot of bad things while i was in it and i i left and pony left and now he's not in the group anymore and oh boy guys this oh this theory this theory's big so sit back enjoy watch until the end and um let's get into this of course i also want to say congrats to these guys on screen for winning our robux code giveaway from last video again if you want to win some robux codes all you got to do be subscribed to the channel and leave a comment down below with your roblox name and i'll pick a winner in the next video well, let's get into this theory because it's pretty big all right so first let's go over a timeline of the piggy infection from when it started to where we are now so that we get an idea of you know when pony was in the group when he left the group all that so when the infection started pony said he immediately joined in the tsp i'm guessing they probably you know rounded him up or something maybe they ran into him whenever he was running away from the piggies and trying to escape the you know initial wave of infection and then he joined the group and he was in the group for presumably a few weeks before he left the group we know from the start of the piggy apart Apocalypse to chapter four. There was a span of four weeks. So that's like four weeks that he was probably in TSP there. And then after that four week period, he probably left because later that night, well, actually, I think later, maybe two nights later, we actually run into him in the chapter seven map or the chapter eight map. Chapter eight map. We run into Pony and Zizzy. So that means that Pony had to have been in the group for probably around three and a half, maybe four weeks. And then, of course, he left, met up with Zizzy. And then that's when we met up with the both of them. Now, in that time period, well, we know that. TSP did some pretty messed up things. We don't know specifics yet, but Pony said that they made him do some, some things that he's not exactly too proud of, which is why he left the group. Now, a lot of people have been thinking about what exactly those things are. Like, what did Pony do while he was in the group? Is Did he steal some stuff? And uh, I see that theory around all the time, and I'm sure they steal some things, but I mean, look, it's the piggy apocalypse. If an apocalypse, if a zombie apocalypse is going on and there's zombies everywhere, of course you're going to steal some stuff. I don't think stealing things in a zombie apocalypse is really that big of a deal so what exactly did pony do I, i'm just gonna say it guys i think pony killed doggy i i I, th I think he did i think i think pony is the one that killed doggy you guys are probably like creek crap what in the world are you talking about this let me explain so there is a note in the carnival map and it is from tsp the silver paw it was written by willow wolf or someone close to willow wolf maybe rash or someone else big in tsp and the note says that doggy and foxy got what was coming to them now of course foxy is locked up on the map foxy is actually inside of the carnival cage he's infected and there's a note in front of the door also from tsp that says don't open monster inside meaning that I, i'm guessing whenever tsp went to the carnival foxy got infected somehow and well they, they locked him in the cage and then foxy turned uh, after after he got you know put in the cage there's actually a note in the cage that says why did my friends leave me here so foxy got uh, i guess attacked they put him in the cage locked him in there and well they left him there to turn into a zombie now that's not really the the weird part the weird part is tsp specifically says that doggy got what was coming to him and we know that willow wolf knows doggy of course, you and Doggy are the ones that arrested Willow Wolf before the apocalypse even started. So obviously, Willow Wolf and TSP doesn't like Doggy. But here's the thing. We never see TSP in the entire first few chapters, which means how in the world would they know what happened to Doggy? The note says that Doggy got what was coming to them, but how would they know what happened to him unless they were there to do it? Now, you might be catching on to what I'm saying here, but, but check this out. Remember back in chapter four, what exactly happens, okay? You and Doggy are asleep in a forest. And then someone comes up and gives Doggy a potion. Put Doggy drinks the potion, and then while well, he turns into the infected zombie. Now a lot of people think it's actually Mr. P that gave Doggy the potion. I guess it could be, but it doesn't really make a lot of sense for Mr. P to be in the forest at that time, just randomly handing out potions. Like he just carries these potions around on himself. He's like, here, have this. That just doesn't really make a lot of sense. Obviously, he's got the potions back at the hospital whenever we go there in the uh, I think chapter six. But he's not just carrying around like a potion belt, just handing out potions to people. So that just doesn't really make a lot of sense and if it was mr p they're handing out potions he probably would have given you one too so why in the world did only doggy get a potion well check this out i think tsp are actually the ones that gave doggy the potion and there's a few reasons for this number one obviously tsp knows what happened to doggy so they had to have either done it to him or they had to have been around the area watching it happen so there's fact number one number two we know that tsp knows exactly what's going on with mr p and the potions simply because they reference it in a note in the chapter 10 mall they say look I, this is what's going on 
along with Mr. P and he is helping us because he's, he's created this mess and is helping us do our things. And of course they're thieves. So the idea that they broke into the hospital, stole maybe one of the potions, it, it's not a crazy idea. It's what they do, they're thieves. Now of course it could have been Willow Wolf that gave Doggy the potion, but here's the thing, all right? Doggy arrested Willow Wolf. If Willow Wolf walked up to you in the middle of a forest, especially after you already arrested her, after you know she's a bad guy and handed you a potion and told you to drink it, you're not gonna do that, all right? Doggy knows Willow Wolf, he knows she's a bad guy, she, he would never do that. He would never drink a potion that Willow Wolf gave him. So Willow Wolf couldn't have done it herself. Here's what Willow Wolf did, all right? Willow Wolf got Pony, okay? It, obviously no one knew who Pony was at the time. Doggy didn't know who Pony was, all right? Willow Wolf got Pony to go up to Doggy and give him the potion while you were sleeping. That's why Doggy drank the potion because it was from, uh, you know, Pony. It wasn't from Willow Wolf. It wasn't from anyone that he knew prior to that. It was from Pony. And well, Pony saw what happened. He, he, he made Doggy turn into an infected uh, piggy. And that's when Pony left the group because after the forest, TSP went to the carnival and then the Foxy stuff happened. And that's when he left the group. He met up with Zizzy. That's why him and Zizzy are there at the carnival. And of course, that's when we meet up with the both of them. This also explains why Pony is so upset over him being in TSP. That's the bad thing he had to do. Because of course, if he had to steal a few things, not, not really a big deal. It's a zombie apocalypse. Not a huge deal. But I think Pony actually is the reason Doggy is infected. I think Pony is the one that actually gave him the potion. And I think that's going to be revealed later on in this book. Of course, that's just a theory. But I think, uh, you know, looking at the timeline, looking at everything that Pony has said, I think everything lines up. Pony is the one that took out Doggy, dude. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you. Write it down. I'm calling it now. And of course, let me know what you think about all this down in the comment section below. I, What do you think? Am I crazy? Do you agree with me? Is, is this big? Let me know down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, though. Uh, again, subscribe if you haven't yet. Hit that sub button. Leave your Roblox name down below in the comment section below. Keep using Star Code to recruit when you're buying your Roblox. Buying your Roblox Premium helps me out a lot, and I really, really do appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for using my Star Code. I'll be reading through all your comments, letting, you know, let, let me know what, what you guys think about this, and uh, leave a comment down below. I'll see you guys next time, all right? Bye!